welcome back to the cloth and paper youtube channel today we're going to be showing you our brand new capsule wardrobe inserts these are going to be launching in the january subscription box so if you're subscribed to the stationery box you will be one of the first to try these out this is what the inserts look like and I'm going to walk through this with you guys and show you how you can use these in your planners. So this is what the inserts look like and they have season and year and then this is where you put your color scheme so it has the main colors, accent colors, and neutrals on the bottom. Right here is the memo so you could either take notes about your look or paste in the picture. And then it has statement pieces, basics, accessories, and extras and your investment wish list. So six other items you might want. And then the back of the capsule wardrobe sheet has a wardrobe inventory, which has item, brand, article, size, color, and cost. So I'm going to go ahead and plan in a look that I've been really wanting to have in my wardrobe, and I'll show you guys all the tools and everything you may need. So the first thing you'll need is, of course, the inserts themselves. You might want to grab a few magazines for inspiration and to pull color from. And then for tools, you'll either need a paper cutter to get precise lines or a pair of scissors. You're also going to want a single hole punch, a glue stick or a tape runner, and I'm also going to use a pair of tweezers just to be more precise when gluing things down. I went through my Pinterest and found a couple of photos that I really liked and cut them down to size. All I did was measure this box and then size it in a Word document to properly fit, and then I printed it out and cut it down with this paper trimmer so I could get really precise clean lines. And then I also printed a few extra pictures to pull color from, and I'll show you guys how I did that in a second. So this is the photo that I'm going to be using to kind of base my capsule wardrobe off of. And what I've done is printed out a few more photos of different color schemes that I thought I might want to wear with this. So all I did was find a spot on this photo that I really liked, and I just punched it. And then retrieved the punch out of the catcher. That way you get a perfect circle to easily glue down and organize your wardrobe. I went ahead and punched a bunch of different colors and patterns that I thought I might use for some of these looks. And then I'll use my tweezers to glue them and place them onto the insert. So now that I have the photo in the memo spot, I'm going to start adding some different color schemes that I might want to pair with this that I know I have in my closet. page looks like. I just took my hole punch and punched out a bunch of different colors that I thought might go with this. But for the main colors, I have black and white as just a basics. And then the neutrals I have are a really nice burnt orange kind of tan color, a really light cream color, and a darker charcoal. And then I also have some accent colors over here, this bright red, this really pretty reddish orange color, and then snakeskin for boots or another accessory. And then down here I just have statement pieces the basics, and any accessories that I have in my closet that I might want to add to this look. I felt really inspired doing this, so I made a couple of extra ones. What's nice about this is that you can start planning ahead for the upcoming months. So this one is a spring slash early summer look with this really cute halter top and jean jacket. Here's another one that I did. I just loved this outfit. Another thing that you could do is add little accessories if you wanted, if you found cutouts in magazines. It's perfect for inspiring your wardrobe and it's really therapeutic to sit down and actually take the time to organize your wardrobe in your planner. And then here's a more simple look, but again, I have a couple of accent pieces, neutrals on the bottom, and then the main colors on the top. So there you have it. Those are the capsule wardrobe inserts that are launching in this month's stationery box. Like I said before, everyone who's already subbed to the stationery box are going to be the first ones to get these and try them out. 
We hope you guys really love these. I had so much fun playing around with this and honestly, it's really, really helpful for actually organizing your wardrobes and getting the most out of your closet. And it was really therapeutic to actually sit down and plan everything out and make everything look aesthetically pleasing. It's just a really good way to organize your wardrobe and have some fun at the same time. Hope you guys love these inserts and enjoyed this video. Make sure to share your photos with us because we cannot wait to see what you guys do with these. Definitely tag us and use the hashtag cloth and paper trail as always to share your photos. Thank you so much for watching and we will see you in the next video. Bye guys!